This is a story I was told. It was August 1973. My brother Jiro was four, sitting at dinner. Eta dakimas, my uncle said. Jiro picked up onigiri, a rice bowl, with his hand and mashed it in his mouth. Fish and rice on his plate, untouched. He stuffed another onigiri in his mouth. Bits of rice falling. Jiro chan! A warning from my mother. Jiro opened his mouth wide. He splayed his tongue around in white beads of rice. Kazuya stood up and roughly pulled Jiro out of his chair. What are you doing? My mother asked, getting up. Kazuya went out the back door, carrying Jiro firmly under his arm. With the other hand, he picked up a circle of rope hanging on the fence by the shed. In the yard was a large oak tree with heavy twisted branches. He wrapped the rope around my brother once. Then he pushed him to the trunk of the oak, winding the rope around and around. He must eat dinner properly. My uncle tied a thick knot at the end. He need to learn to be a man. My mother was shouting at my uncle. Jiro was screaming. The sound flooding the sky. <laughs> Mom, help me. <laughs> uncle Kazuya, please stop. <laughs> Kazuya went back into the house, relaxed and entitled, as if he had just finished a long day's work. No one remembers the rest. My mother never forgave my uncle. My father wasn't there. Jiro can't recall any of it. He jokes that the incident is possibly the reason he always intuitively eats everything on his plate. That's all guys. I hope you learn and enjoy. Thank you for watching.